Hey everybody, Anne here, and today we're going to check out my worm bin. It's been a while since I've done a video, and I think I've got some exciting news. Well, you know, for those who like worms at any rate, I know y'all think I'm weird for keeping a worm bin in my van, but it's really awesome. It's fun to watch. So yeah, let me, let me show you what I got going on here. Okay, first of all, this is the worm bin. It's just a cooler. It's not... It's not airtight, um, so air can get in and out. It is in the like the passenger seat right down in here. And open it up. And let's see what we've got going on here. Oh, I don't know if you can see, but there right over here is a baby worm. Oh, it disappeared. And there is, I don't know if you can see it. There was a, another baby worm right in there so I'm just going to kind of dig in it and see what we've got going on. Big fat worms they're all doing well they're alive it's a little cold so they're moving a little bit slower but they're all doing just fine. Let's dig a little bit deeper Oh, see, we've got ones of all different sizes in there. Let me look here. Yep, we've got baby worms. Little tiny baby worms. We've got actually a lot of baby worms. Look! A baby worm. There's a ton of them. Let's see what's over in this corner. Another baby one. Yay. A big one escaping. Now, I don't know if these are red worms, the baby ones, or, oh, look at all those worms, or if they're the night crawlers, like this one, because I've got both in this bin. But there are an absolute ton of new worms. Worms of all different sizes. Let's see if I can find any cocoons. The lighting is not the greatest right here, but that's okay. But they are slowly but surely digesting this bedding. There's still quite a lot to go. I probably could have started with some more worms. And I don't know if you remember, but this is the stuff that I bought from Walmart. And um, it just is kind of like chewed up you know, cardboard, paper, and whatnot, and you got to wet it down. And so they've been existing very happily in here. Oh, look at, look at. There's another big fat one down there. Can you see? Gosh, I wish I had better light. So we still got plenty of the night crawlers in there. There's just a lot of worms of all different. Look at, there's a baby. Look. Look at my baby worm and my big worms. I've got all kinds. Okay, I'm going to dig through here and see if I can find any cocoons. And I'll show you. Okay. Check that out. That's one big cocoon. I'm wondering if that's a nightcrawler cocoon. Because normally the red wiggler cocoons don't really look that big. So, yeah, we got one cocoon there. I'm betting there's a ton more. Let's see if I take this lid away. That'll give us a little bit more light. But I just keep on covering layers and layers. And with each layer, there's a ton more worms. Just a ton. There's baby worms. There's old worms, young worms, all different kinds of worms in here. Look at all of them. So I still have plenty of the night crawlers, and I think that their population has definitely increased. Um, goodness gracious. I don't know which ones are breeding better. See, these are... Mm, 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 mm. I think these are just the red wigglers, these right here, the red worms. And there's just an absolute ton. And I think I started with only about maybe 10 night crawlers and about 30 um, 
30 red wigglers. And the last time I counted them, I think there was like around 80. <laughs> so, I mean, the breeding is actually going, going slow. I don't know if they slow down in the winter time, but um, what's this? What is that? Hmm. That doesn't look like a worm that I want. I don't know if you can see this. If anybody knows what this is. All right, come on now. Let's get this in focus. Come on, come on. Well, it doesn't look like a worm. <laughs> it looks like something else, so I am chucking it. Gross. Ew. <laughs> Definitely don't want that in there. Um, but there are a lot. Of, oh, oh my goodness. There's a lot of freaking worms in here now. I don't even know if I could count them. I'm not going to. I think we're beyond that. I know that this bin is healthy. It's working out great. And, um, oh, I just saw another cocoon. This bedding is working out great. There is an absolute ton of worms in here. So I am going to feed them a little bit of cornmeal. Let me find my cornmeal. Okay, I'm just going to kind of dust some around here. I think that this is the last of it. It's actually Jiffy Cornmeal. Um, there we go. I'm going to have to get some more cornmeal. I also feed them coffee grounds every once in a while. I know that's good for them. I haven't started using crushed up eggshells yet, but I probably will very soon. But they are just doing really well. So you know what? I think that this warm bin and this little cooler is working out just fine. I was afraid that they would all die because I don't have holes drilled in it. Um, but they are all doing just fine. So let's go ahead and clean this back up. And wait till the next time. Yay! Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.